Hello, everyone. Welcome to Gerontology of Traditional Chinese Medicine. As we know, aging refers to the natural decline of the human body's tissue structure and physiological function, which is closely related to the occurrence of many chronic diseases. Let's look at the manifestation of aging first. One, the manifestation of aging mainly from height, weight, body surface area, bust, abdominal circumference, breathing, nails, skin, eyes, and ears. Elderly osteoporosis patients are usually with low height, since a compression of the vertebral broad body of the spine, atrophy of the intervertebral disc, anterior curvature of the spine, curvature of the buttocks, curvature of the lower extremities, and other factors. While the body weight of them is increased at first, then decreased, the elderly often suffer from kyphosis and sternum postrotion, the anteroposterior diameter of the rib cage, and the ratio of the anterior posterior diameter to the left right diameter increases. The upper intercostal space widens. The chest circumference gradually decreases with age, especially in women, which may be related to the breast atrophy and muscle relaxation. According to the difference of gender, nutrition, and the physical activity, abdominal circumference varies significantly with age. If men have less physical activity and overnutrition, the abdominal circumference will increase slightly with no significant changes. But the abdominal circumference will decrease after 80 years of age. When the female age increases to 60 to 70 years old, the abdominal circumference will increase with the accumulation of the abdominal fat and gradually decreases after 70 years old. The shape of the nail gradually becomes flat with age and is even shaping like a spoon. The surface of the nail can see longitudinal and slightly ridged stripes. Age spots and white spots appear with age. Age spots are punctate pigmentation with clear margin, which are tan spots not raised or slightly raised on the surface, and can be distributed throughout the body, especially on the skin of the face, neck, chest, back, and limbs. White spot is a kind of discolored plague of the skin, which is dot-shaped and distributed throughout the body, and is more common in the limbs, chest, and back. At the same time, since a reduced sebaceous gland secretion, the skin of the elderly is rough and itching, wrinkles appear due to the rough and satchel skin with reduced elasticity, and lower eyelid is swollen forming an eye bag. The same capillaries are decreased and degenerated with increased brittleness. With increasing age, the density of skin nerve endings decreases significantly, resulting in hyperfunction of regulating skin temperature and feeling dull. With age, degenerated changes of the lens of the eye can lead to the opacity of the lens, also known as senile cataract. The lens of the pinna and the ratio of the ear length or height gradually increase with age, and it is more obvious after 70 years of age. Ear lobe folds also gradually appear with age, and some people believe that ear lobe folds are an indication of coronary atherosclerosis. 2. Physiological Manifestations of Aging In the process of human aging, the holistic function declines that the body's homostatus adjustment range is narrowed, and the response, adaptability, immunity, and reverse capacity are affected. Some viscera even lost functions, such as a woman's overall stop ovulating after the menstrual period. The basic structural changes are cell atrophy, number decrease, intracellular lipofunction deposition, increased intracellular substance, tissue fibrosis, and hardening, which lead to the reduction of organ volume and weight, resulting in the degeneration of various system functions. Next, let's learn about the mechanism of aging. The mechanism of aging is relatively complicated, and there are many mechanism theories. Today, we focus on four theories. 1. Cell aging. Cells are the basic unit of biological structure and function, and aging clear characteristics at the cellular level. Cellular aging refers to the phenomenon that cells stop dividing, becoming larger and spreading flat, with point-like agglutination of heterochromation 
and increase particles. The most typical cell aging marker is positive P glycoside staining. Cellular aging is generally divided into replicative aging and precautious aging, also known as stress aging and developmental aging. Cell aging is a normal physiological phenomenon which plays a role in the embryonic stage and belongs to the controllable process. The aging cells of the ear increase significantly and enter an uncontrollable stage, leading to tumorigenesis and other senile diseases. 2. Shortened telomere wear Telomere is a special structure composed of short DNA repeats, located at the ends of chromosomes. Its function is to maintain the stability of chromosome structure and avoid fusion of chromosome ends. Telomeres keeps its length stable by extending telomere. After the telomere length of blood lysis of people is in different ages was detected, it was found that the telomere of the elderly was significantly shortened, and the telomere length was significantly related to age. Through the study of the overall scanning of human chromosomes, DNA damage reactions were found during telomere shortening, and the reactive oxygen radicals were significantly increased resulting in an imbalance in genism and starting the process of cell aging. Using radiation to cause telomere damage, it can be observed that the damage cannot be repaired, and the DNA damage response system is continuously activated, leading to cell aging. 3. Mitochondrial dysfunction Mitochondria are important organisms in cells, which mainly produce ATP to provide the energy required by the body's physiological functions. Mitochondrial dysfunction is one of the main causes of aging. The difficulty of cell aging in cells with mitochondria removed also proves a close relationship between mitochondria and aging. Under normal circumstances, cells clear damaged mitochondria by mitochondria autography. In this process, the mitochondria is specifically labeled, combined with autophagosomes and transported to the lysomes for digestion. When the mitochondria autophagy mechanism is abnormal, it cannot function normally, causing a large number of unhealthy mitochondria to accumulate in the cell, producing many free radicals, causing cell aging and other adverse effects. 3. Influence of circadial rhythm The circadial rhythm control center is called the circadial clock. It's located in our brain. It receives light, temperature, and other star signals to control the operation of the peripheral cadarian clock. It regulates a variety of physiological functions such as immune function, hormone secretion, metabolism, stress, sleep initiation, and arousal. And its dysfunction is closely related to the occurrence of metabolic syndrome, tumor, cardiovascular and cerebrovascular diseases and mental diseases. It can be said that it is one of the most important factors causing and affecting senile diseases. For example, melatonin is synthesized in the pineal gland, and moderate supplementation of it can improve the sleep of the elderly. 2. Understanding of aging mechanism in TCN 1. The theory of fight zone organs, Athenian causing aging, believes that the spleen and the kidney are most closely related to aging. The chapter of the Universal Truth in Su Wen said, At seven years of age, the woman's kidney energy becomes full, her permanent teeth come in, and her hair grows long. At 14 years, the Tian Gui matures, the Ren and Chong channels responsible for conception open. Menstruation begins and conception is possible. At 21 years, the kidney energy is strong and healthy. At 49 years, the Ren and Chong channels are completely empty and the Tian Gui has dried up. In the male, at 8 years of age, the kidney energy becomes full, the permanent teeth appear, and the hair becomes long. At 16 years of age, the kidney energy is ample. At 24 years old, the kidney cheese is abundant. At 48, the yin energy of the head begins to deplete. By 56 years, the liver energy weakens, tian gui dries up, and the jing essence is drained, resulting in kidney exhaustion, fatigue, and weakness. Deficiency of kidney qi The growth, development, and aging of the human body are closely related to 
Athenia of spleen and stomach. The spleen and stomach are the foundation acquired after birth, the container of water and food, and the source of chi and blood. All substances that are necessary for growth and maintaining life rely on transporting and transforming functions of the spleen and stomach. A chapter of the universal truth ensues instead. At thirty-five years, the yangming and large intestine channels that govern the major facial muscles begin to deplete. The muscles begin to atrophy, facial wrinkles appear, and the hair begins to thin. In this regard, the hypofunction of spleen and stomach is an important mechanism leading to aging. Recent studies have also supported the view that aging is associated with the athenia of the spleen and stomach. Relevant reports suggest that the spleen deficiency syndrome marked by dysfunction of digestive system, while healthy elderly people have the same characteristic. Clinical pathological anatomical data prove that there are more than two athenia viscous in patients with athenia syndromes in most cases based on TCM, of which athenia of the spleen and kidney is the most common. The pathological changes of the gastrointestinal tract accounted for. 88.5 percent, and all cases all over 80 years old have pathological changes of the gastrointestinal tract and kidney. The above data show that the athenia of spleen and stomach is closely related to aging. When we try to delay aging, prevent and treat senile disease, the function of spleen and stomach should not be ignored, which is particularly important for the very old people. The theory of weakness caused by blood stasis. This theory originated from Huang Di Neijing. The classics treatise on the secret classic of the holy chamber, plain conversation, said, "If the spirit is distributed unclear, the other organs will not function properly. This creates damage. The shi dao will become blocked. Health will suffer. The shi dao is a bloodline, which indicates that the blood stasis impedes the health and longevity." So far, blood state theory have developed rapidly with many achievements, and the aging caused by blood status has been paid more and more attention. Okay, that's all for today. Bye.